Hi, I'm Chris from Techable, and today we're going to take a look at the top five issues with MacBooks that you can fix at home. If you're having issues with your trackpad, where it's glitching all over the place or randomly clicking, you should try this. To clean the trackpad on your MacBook, you're going to need to take a microfiber cloth with a little bit of alcohol and you're going to go around the edges of the trackpad. This is to remove dust particles and debris that may have gotten stuck in there. That will fix things like a stuck, jumpy, or glitchy mouse. Are you having issues with your date and time? Mouse have a mind of its own? Got screen issues? Or the volume is stuck? You should try resetting the PRAM. All right, to perform a PRAM reset with your left hand, hold Command, Option, and R. With your right hand, hold P and the power button. The laptop will cycle, you'll hear the gong, and then it will go off, and then once it does that, you can turn it back on, and you will have successfully done a PRAM reset, or an NVRAM reset. Are your fans being too loud? Is your keyboard backlight not coming on? Having issues with your power? Or is your Mac just being too slow? An SMC reset may be the solution. This is how you perform an SMC reset on your MacBook. With it plugged in and turned off, with your left hand, hold Shift Control Option. With your right hand, hold the power button. Hold it for 10 seconds. And then once you let go, you will notice the light on the charger will turn green. That is an indicator that the SMC has been reset. Is your MacBook acting up and you're not sure why? A great place to start is the Apple Diagnostic Test. When you run that, it'll show you if you have any hardware issues. This is how you run diagnostics on your MacBook. With the MacBook turned off, hold Option and D and then press the power button. Still holding Option and D, the computer will boot into Diagnostic, ask you for your network, you put your network in and it will begin the diagnostic. Do you see a question mark folder on your screen? Have you recently installed a new hard drive? Do you need to get a new operating system? Try performing an internet recovery. To perform an internet recovery on your MacBook, while it's off, hold Command, Option, and R, and then the power button. This will take you to the internet screen. Simply put in your internet information, follow the steps provided, and note that the operating system download may take anywhere from an hour to two hours, depending on the system. Well, that's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. In the comment section below, let us know, did we miss anything? Is there something you want us to cover in the future? Leave it in the comment section below. And as always, follow us on social media, and for all things tech, visit techable.com.